Hello everybody, what is going on? It's me, Kofu, and today I'm doing another vlog. And this vlog is a little bit different because it's just basically to tell you guys my Black Friday, yes, like what I bought on Black Friday. And this could be like a little review, something I've been wanting to do for a while. And what I got was this guy. It's a little GoPro camera. It's called the Akaso EK7000. Uh, this is like a, like the second version of GoPro, but it's a lot more, uh, what I say, like, friendly, like, uh, com like, it's like for the, com like for any, uh, anybody that wants to get started in vlogging, I would say, because it also comes with, like, uh, accessories and stuff like that that you can go buy along with the, this camera, so I have this right here, which basically I could just attach it to the thing, and I just use it like a vlogging camera the screens right there you guys can see and uh, here's your, your little I don't know if you guys can clearly see that maybe uh, I don't know if that's gonna focus in no but it there's like a port for your micro SD card here there's like uh, maybe charging cable here and another one for that but that one is for this other accessory that I got it's for the microphone that I have bought. It's the, I guess it's just called the Akaso external microphone. I just plug this in and it works with external microphones. Uh, this thing does have a built-in microphone, but right now I'm going to show you guys the difference between the two, between the built-in and the microphone external. So you guys will see that in a moment. Well, I hope this camera works. This is a Akaso 4K EK7000 camera. I bought this on Amazon and I don't know how well it is, but once I upload this video, it might be a little bit better. Who knows? It's uh, The footage is unedited Oop, and I knocked over with the camera, but I'm trying in the built-in microphone. So next thing I'm going to do is try to uh, change it to this Akaso external microphone that I have right here. Uh, pretty sure. And I'm going to see how well this will turn out. So one moment, please. Hello, testing. This is the Akaso external microphone. Testing, testing. I hope this is working. I hope this is working I don't know tapping the microphone I'm pretty sure it could be heard it can't be heard I don't know but it might sound a lot better than the built-in microphone who knows but I feel like this quality camera is not bad because of the 4,000 reviews or is it 4,000 reviews I don't know uh, looking on the ca uh, looking on Amazon right now though this was a really good, uh, really good microphone from what it looks like, and uh, it's, it went really down in price during Black Friday when I picked this up. So I got it, see how well it uh, tested, and right now it's pretty, pretty amazing. Thirty-six thousand ratings and having a four point four out of five stars, which means this is pretty high quality for a camera a gopro camera or action camera i think that's what it's called but let me know how it goes on your end guys so yeah that was basically the akaso ek7000 camera action camera it's basically like gopro somewhat like i said and it could be used as a vlogging camera because of how lightweight this is like literally this this could be like at least a pound holding this or maybe less than that uh not much i can say but it's really amazing i really do recommend if you guys want to start vlogging i would try to get yourself this this external this external eh, this external microphone along with the camera because when i'm playing back the the audio quality with the built-in it's not that good but if you don't want to spend a couple extra dollars to get this microphone then your best bet is to be using this with the built-in camera or built-in microphone I'm sorry 
and yeah I would say I'll be using not only this one that I'm using right now for my vlogs but I might also try to switch it up with this just to try and try to give it a tr give it a good use not only that though but with uh, 36,000 36,000 like ratings or reviews on these things it's not bad not bad with 4.4 out of 5 stars I would say this is really worth it I would give it a go if you guys want to get started with uh with vlogging and stuff like that like me well for me I'm using a different type of uh, using a different type of camera I'm using a Canon Rebel T3i camera and it's it's amazing I like using this one because this one's really really amazing but the problem is though it's heavy I'll tell you that much it weighs on my on my wrist yeah, so I really really suggest either that one or this one this one I would say I would use for a backup for me personally but for other uses I think this will be about a lot more better this Akaso camera my goodness I, I'm impressed I'm really impressed with this camera so I would uh, I would advise if you guys want to start vlogging get yourself an EK a or EK 7000 Akaso camera this is a this was like a vlog review I would say but I would say it's mostly a vlog for me because I rarely get to do stuff anymore with these kind of real life cameras and um, that's for that that's for that camera but I have some other things I want to get off my chest you guys know about my Lion King uh, my Lion King uh, fash or favoritism and stuff like that I think it's time that I explain to you guys like what I got from Disney on Broadway besides of my plushie that I showed off a long time ago there were other things there were other things as well I think it's time that I showed you guys that one moment please I'm gonna go grab them alrighty guys I already showed you about this guy <laughs> I love this I love this this is so cute his arms are movable like I said the head doesn't move sadly but I think Oh, the legs do move too, so you can position him just basically like Rafiki in The Lion King. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh wow, I can't believe I'm still holding this one. This is adorable. And apparently this is number 1485. Literally, this is number 1,485. I don't know if you guys can see that clearly. I don't know why it's not focusing. Maybe. There we go. Uh, okay, there we go. It says 1,485. So yeah, that that's really amazing. And let me try to focus myself again. There we go. Uh, this is pretty cute. Very, very cute. Oh, there we go. Very cute indeed. The whole have baby Simba. Like I, once I went to the Broadway, I had to bring back some memorabilia for myself. And this, this is something that I, oh, I thought I had to bring home from the Broadway show, Broadway musical. This is so cute. It's Simba. How can you not like him? Now. <clears throat> The other thing I have brought home, well, obviously these were promotional flyers, and I'm gonna try to blur out where it was hosted from, but these are like little promotional little flyers that they handed it out. Obviously it's not much of a, well I have two of them, that's why I'm holding it like this, but it's basically, it explains uh, the show itself. Um, it's just obviously it's promoting the show obviously for anybody that wants to watch it like literally me uh, it just basically describes on the back of it <clears throat> more than a hundred million people around the world have experienced the phenomenon of Disney's The Lion King and now you can too when this beloved mess musical returns to my city Apparently, yeah, it came to my city before and I didn't know. Uh, this landmark musical event brings together one of the most imaginative, creative teams on Broadway. T 
Tony Award winning director Julie Tamer, I don't know if I'm saying that name right, sorry if I butchered your name, brings life the story with hope and adventure set against the amazing backdrop of stunning visuals. Yes, the show had amazing visuals, I'll tell you that much guys. And also, the best music. The best music, oh, there goes the light for that, the best music from Elton John and Tim Rice, of course. There's nothing like The Lion King on Broadway, and I have to admit, it was a life-changing event for me. I crossed something off the bucket list, and I was able to enjoy The Lion King. So I had to, I had to pick up two, because one wasn't enough for me. So, I had two. And also, I'm not sure if I'm allowed to show this though, but it does, I think it would give, give away though, but I have the tickets. I'm holding the tickets. The tickets uh, for The Lion King Broadway. Like this is something I held very dear and close. Like I was holding this piece of envelope very close to me because I did not want to lose this. Because I booked the I booked ahead. I, I reserved the seat for myself for the Broadway. One of the best seats actually. And it cost me at the time and let's see if I can see how much it is. $199, believe it or not. This was $199. The best money that I paid to watch one of my favorite shows of all time. So yeah, that was that. And I'm still happy that I have it. Now then. And of course, what other Broadway show would not have but... A playbill. They had a playbill right here of the Lion King, and I'm trying to cover like the the address of where this was played at because I don't want people to know where I am and where I watched it. But inside the playbill, it has uh, let's see. Oh, it has like this little pamphlet here inside. I, it gave me two of them. I don't know why, but it describes in detail. Describes in detail who played who. It, it tells me who played Rafiki, Mufasa, Sarabi, Zazu, Scar, Simba, Nala, young Simba and young Nala. Yes, they had had the whole entire show. They had the whole entire show cast and crew right here in this little this little book or this little piece of paper. But it also describes in this playbill <clears throat> uh, all the how do I say this? Like everybody that was working behind the stage too, so that that shows the credit to whoever was there, and that is amazing. I'll I won't I won't deny like it's amazing, and it also describes I think in here. Uh, I think it like oh the like who was who the, who was in the cast basically they, they gave like a little brief description summary about each each performer, which is amazing. And it's a life-changing story for some of these. I didn't get a chance to read all of it, but my god, it's amazing. So this is a this is a memorabilia of its own, and I'm gonna hold on to it. Now the next things I I obviously had to get it's a Lion King jacket. It's a it's it has the Lion King written on one of the sleeves. I think I bought a um an extra large was it? Was this extra? Is this extra large? Yeah, this is extra large because uh, it's really, really warm. This thing can keep me warm, but it can't. It can't. Um, can't keep me really, really warm during the winter times. That's for sure. But maybe during really cold fall weather, this is amazing. So that's that's that. Now the next things that I got, it came together because with the package deal that they gave me. They gave me uh, two things. Hold on a second. This is a really big one because it's a little big book. Well, what I, I don't know why I say little big, but it's a really, really big book. And again, it just, it's just describes everybody in this little piece right here. This, this came with it. It shows everybody who played in it, like all the actors actresses everybody 
whoever was controlling the lights, the music, everything was written in this little piece. But in this one, oh my god, this. This is like everything I could ever dream of. Like, it, it shows everything. Like, who, uh, who was behind this whole great show? Yeah, it shows everything. Like, how it, it all began. And obviously it began with the movie. And so, I guess the team behind it all decided, why not take it to Broadway? And that was the best decision they ever did. And oh my god, it shows like the design of the costumes, the makeup, the story behind it all. Oh my god, this is amazing. Like, truly astounding. It even has quotes from the movie, or not the movie, from the show. Learn to respect. That is a good quote too. As a king, you must learn to respect that balance. Wow. I remember that line very fondly. Oh my god. <laughs> and also, there was amazing choreograph. There was, there was amazing dancing. There was amazing, it was, it was, yeah. I, I obviously, this was a long time ago, but I think I had to re-upload this or remake this video because I didn't show what else I got from the, from the show itself. Because, it deserves to be shown to you guys. It really does. So, it, it also came with this little bag. The book came with this bag because I purchased it with a, I guess it was a VIP deal. And this bag is almost really something I would love to wear every day. But because it's a collector's item, for any kind of Lion King advocate like myself, or a Lion King enthusiast like myself, I'm not going to. Uh, I'm not going to use this. I'm gonna keep it as it is. <laughs> but along with that, I got myself another bag. Another bag. A tote bag, obviously. This tote bag is, well, a tote bag. <laughs> it's really big and. This is the this is number four thousand seven hundred and seventy six. They sold a lot of these, that's for sure. So I had to get myself one of those. And lastly, and certainly not least, I got myself a shirt. The Lion King, the world's number one musical. I so want to wear this. I really, really would love to wear this. <laughs> oh my god, but look at this. Look how beautiful this is. I mean, you can't get better. You can't get anything better than that. You really can't. Oh wow. This is very, very beautiful. Well, that's much I could say about this vlog right now. Oh my god, that was pretty, pretty amazing. Whew. That blog, uh, that collection of all my Lion King Broadway stuff. <laughs> that was a lot, I'll tell you that much. Well, so to summarize the video today, if you want to get started in vlogging, get yourself this camera. And if you guys would be interested in going to the show of The Lion King on Broadway, go ahead. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity and I advise you guys watch it. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you guys did, please leave a like and a comment down below. If you guys are brand new to the channel, hit that subscribe button for more videos like this. I have a Minecraft channel. Check the link in the description down below. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Take care now.